Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god. Ha. 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 Hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to God's Basement Chapter 5. We are on technically part 3 of the series. I don't remember anything. It's been a while since we visited this, so we are jumping back into it. And that door's locked. Fantastic. Ooh. Hello? Uh huh. This is a uh, house devoid of any love and joy. I'm entering my first year of high school. I'm nervous about it, but I'm excited at the same time. My grandmother was recently diagnosed with Parkinson's disease. The diagnosis didn't really face her. She seems a lot less lively these days, just listening to the radio or TV most of the time. I try to talk to her about current events and casual topics, but her responses are more bleak and dull than they used to be. I wouldn't describe her aura as depressing or gloomy. A more precise word would be hollow or empty. It's almost as if part of her has drifted off somewhere and has yet to return. She would have episodes like this before, but the frequency and length of the episodes seem to be increasing. Convenient. This is even... Okay, this is just too dark to even see what's going on in here. Ooh. Is that nothing? Ooh, I hear stuff in the background. Problem is, it's too dark. I don't really. Twelve seconds later. Oh, that's right. I have a flashlight. <laughs> All right. Hello. Wait, wasn't I just here before? What the fuck? No, are you kidding? No, that's locked. I'm gonna go this way. That's also- are you- Oh god, it, it do it in doing the, the, the mind infinite maze thing, don't it? Oh god damn it. Alright, alright. Nothing in here. Nana? Nana? Don't be creepy, I want to help you out, but if your Parkinson's is getting you fucking ghostly powers, I want to know about it. It's something you might need to talk about. Alright. <laughs> is it really just gonna keep looping? What? <gasps> no, but the, there was a door here, but that door is missing. Right? The door in here is missing. Radio. Okay. Is there anything on her chair? Oh. That's so weird. No. Oh wait, a letter. I didn't even see this. I'm sorry. James, I'm sorry to bother you, but I've misplaced my keys somewhere. Can you please find them for me? I've just placed them next to this note once you found them. Ooh. Okay. The keys. Did you pack them away somewhere? Hmm. This door is locked though. Yeah, okay, so don't even bother going in there. It's probably in the room I was just in, but I didn't see anything we could pick up. Did I seriously pass these keys like six times? To land it, today I landed a part-time job during my tutoring, uh, tutoring my neighbor's kit. I can't get a real job yet since I'm only 14, but at least this will give me some kind of income. Regarding my grandmother's health, there have been no major changes. She remains uninterested and perpetually distant whenever I interact with her. Some kind of strange hap- something kind of strange happened today. I caught her having a conversation with the radio. The thing is, the radio was off the whole time. She was arguing back and forth with it, as if it were a real human being. It was kind of reminding me of the crazy people you have to deal with when ta taking public transit. It's kind of messed up that I found it just a tiny bit funny. I'll probably be set for hell for laughing at it, but I couldn't help it. I have a sick sense of humor. I love her to death and it pains me to see her deteriorate like this. I hope she gets better. Alright, should we go talk to the radio then? I already- there's- there's only these notes, so... Oh. I feel like something has to happen in this room. The problem is there's really nothing going on. Oh, that's just a random ass cup. I read all the notes. No, that's still not opening. Hmm. Hmm. 
No? Can't even... Can't even interact with this door. Hmm. There, there is something clearly I'm fucking missing, but I just don't get it. I really don't. I'm dumb. <laughs> I'm dumb. Alright, let's set it next to these keys. Achievement unlocked key finder. That's it? I don't get a reward for finding your keys, Nana. For you missing your shit constantly. Yeah, I did find them. Hmm. Nana, I feel like you're not being honest with me. Okay, I've done above and beyond what you've asked for. This is around here. <laughs> what? Are you serious? Was that seriously the whole thing the whole fucking time? <sighs> Oh my god. <laughs> no thank you, I don't want to partake in this adventure. Let me close the door again. Okay. Uh... Oh. How about this one? Nada. Alright, I guess we're going here. No, but this is off too. What the fuck? Wait, why? Okay, so I go back. What the hell? Oh! Wait. Uh huh, this wasn't like this. Okay, the note is gone. So this is a new one. Last night I caught my grandmother staring at a painting in the middle of the hallway. It was in the middle of the night and her eyes were locked onto the picture. It was kind of eerie seeing her in trance by- After staring at it for at least half an hour, she walked off casually. I took a closer look at the painting and it was completely blank. It was literally a blank piece of paper she was staring at. At least I have some good news. I've earned a raise for my tutoring job and I've started tutoring my neighbor's kids to earn more money. Yay! I wrapped up my first year of high school so I'm glad I have something to keep me busy throughout the summer besides taking care of my grandmother. Yeah, this is fucking. This is creepy. Wait, do I have to? Wait, wait, maybe. Wait, 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 wait. Maybe that's what I have to do. Right? Like. No. <gasps> oh, oh, wait, what about this one? No. Oh, he never. Wait, he never. What? He never forgive. You. Will. You? Oh, wait, I have to do this in order? Did it- wait. Okay, oh, he will He will. Which one? Where, where was Never? Never's gotta be around, right? No. Uh, the one next to he. He will. Never. Where was Forgive, though? No, that's you. Forgive you. Is that right? Wait, wait, wait. what does that do for me though? He will never forgive you. Fuck. Is it this door? There are too many goddamn doors in the goddamn game. This is getting trippy as hell with all these fucking doors everywhere. 
<laughs> no, it can't open that one. <gasps> okay, this hallway is gonna disappear like the other one, right? Okay. I woke up in the middle of the night to the sound of plates breaking. I dashed out of my room to see what was happening. I saw her in the kitchen repeatedly trying to carry a plate from the kitchen to the dining room. While walking over to the dining room, she would drop the plate and repeat the process. What? I walked over to her and guided her back to her bedroom. I set up a small barricade so she wouldn't be able to get out so easily. She could have really hurt herself. Maybe she set up a small barricade. Set up a barricade so she doesn't get out of her room at night. I'm in the middle of my second year of high school right now, and it's been really hard balancing school, friends, and taking care of my grandmother. Most of the time I have to turn down social events because I have to stay home and make sure she doesn't do anything crazy. That's that's rough, dude. Wait, what do I Oop. Wait, he woke wait. Oh, hold on. I think I got it. I think I understand this. Hold on. I hate doing this. I feel like I have to make it night. Right? Like... Right? I have to do something. Hold on. Mm. These plates are gonna break because it's all themed. It's all themed with the notes. Right? It has to be thematic with the notes, so then I have to make it nighttime. That sucks. I mean, I think she got Parkinson's or she's got a brain injury uh, from that day at the accident, so she just it's just naturally devolving. She probably suffered a major brain injury. What the fuck? Wait, I'm back. Rocking chair achievement unlocked. Oh, I have to stare at this. Wait, do I have to? Wait, it, what? In this place, he does not dwell. Hell, he God is not present. No one here will really help you. Here. I'm starting to panic. Okay, I'm starting to panic a little bit. Okay, I went out. I went out. <gasps> oh! She's gonna run at me. She's gonna run at me. Bitch. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please, please don't run at me. Please don't run at me. 
No. Okay. 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 Oh my god. Ho. Oh. Oh. Ho. Oh. Ho. Wait. Oh wait. I'm back here. Wait, quick, open the door. I'm right back here. Oh. This is like a living room. I'm starting to starting to worry about the future. Grandma's condition continues to get worse if she's not going to stay like this for the rest of her life. I hope not. What will happen if I have to leave for college? Who's going to take care of her? The way it is now, I can barely leave her alone for two seconds without her breaking something. I'm currently in my third year of high school, so it's a little bit of time to think about that. Hopefully I'll come up with a solution later. Yeah, dude, that's really fucking tough. I don't even- <sighs> What was that light? Does it go in a- Does it go in a square? <coughs> it just swallowed me on spit. <laughs> What the Quasimodo fuck is this? Bunny? Oh, I need to get a hammer. I need to get a hammer. That's what that's for, right? I need a hammer. Oh my god, I hope this hurts. <laughs> I don't want to play this game anymore. It's so good. It's a door. Oh goddamn never ending hallways bullshit, man. Oh, that's the TV again. Oh. Uh is something there's nothing happening on the TV, it's just... It's just showing me. Alright. Mm, this is no bueno-ski. No bueno-ski. Ooh, shit. Alright, let's try going this way. Nope. <laughs> Nope. There seems to be a theme here. Can't open this door either. What the fuck is happening? I guess I have to go back to the living room. <gasps> oh, maybe there's a note that I missed. Oh, it's probably a note I missed. There it is. There's a note. Okay. I just entered my senior year of high school, starting to think about how to after high school. I recently applied for a scholarship. It would pay for basically all my expenses, including tuition, room and board, and everything else. My biggest issue right now is my grandmother. You don't really have any relatives or anyone to take care of her besides me. Will I have to take care of her for the rest of her life? The answer seems to be yes. Her condition keeps getting worse and worse. I know this is selfish, but I feel quite bitter about the current situation. I keep having to make sacrifices for her sake. Hopefully, I'll think of a solution rather than later. Sooner rather than later. Hey, look. We need to talk. Oh, she's getting closer. I'm lowering the volume. Oh, fuck, I'm lowering the volume. Okay. Oh. 
well, that's all the time I have for this episode, guys. Sorry to leave you on this huge cliffhanger. I just took a look at the time. I'm running a little bit over. So I will see you in the next episode. Please leave a like if you enjoyed and subscribe for more content. And I will see you in the next episode. Peace. <gasps>